Hi everyone, this is the PLC Fiddle On Delay Timer Challenge Solution. And here is my PLC Fiddle. The link to this is in the notes below. And what you'll see is this allows us to uh, solve, the, it, solve the problem of the delay the motor start 10 seconds. And so when we press the start button, the motor will delay 10 seconds um, and then it will start. So if we look at the timing chart of this, here it is here. So we hit the start and then we have a 10 second delay before the motor actually turns on. So that is our timing chart of what we want to see in our diagram here. So we're giving uh, some of our delay bit and we have a timer and that timer, if you scroll down here, you'll see our preset is 10 seconds. So let's look at the code itself. We'll change currently right now. We don't want to go directly to the motor. We want to go to a delay bit. So we'll do that delay bit here and then our ceiling for a delay bit. Then what we'll do is we'll add our variable for the delay bit. Um, also we'll need our timer when it expires, so our timer after 10 seconds, and then we'll have our coil, which is our motor, come on. And then we'll go back to our contacts, we'll put another, our delay bit here. That will actually start our timer, which is our on delay timer. We'll select timer from there. So. That looks like our circuit, and we'll test this out. Let's just uh, let's go down here to take a look at our preset value. So we'll hit the start button. Our start button does our delay. Our delay now starts our timer. Our accumulation goes up to our 10 seconds. The timer comes on, and then the motor turns on. So that looks like it will. It works well. We'll turn off our start, we'll start hit stop, and everything now resets again, and we can time that again. Right up to 10 seconds, and then it will turn on. So looking back at our diagram, we hit the start, we delay the 10 seconds, and the output turns on. So that looks exactly like um, our timing chart. Now, all the links and documentation can be found on our website at accautomation.ca. And if you like this video and like to see more, there are three ways in which you can help us out. You can give us a thumbs up so other people can find this information. You can subscribe to our YouTube channel. You can also go to ACC Automation and subscribe to our website. When you do, notification will be given to you every time we publish new content to the site. You will also get two free ebooks on numbering systems and robust data logging. And the third thing to do to help us out is to tell a friend or colleague about the site. Alright, that's it for now. Thanks for watching.